Hey, what's up everyone and welcome back. My name is Keptendo and I got some really cool avatars to show you for today. So today I'm gonna to be showing off, it is called the, I guess his name's Ethan. That's what the avatar says uh, from Pokemon. It's that guy right there actually. <laughs> and what this avatar does or what all these avatars in this world do is they allow you to actually have Pokemon battles with other players. <laughs> it's really cool. So the world that I am in for today's video is a PC Quest world called the Pokemon Battling Avatars Beta over here by Leela. And once you get into this world, what you'll do is you'll start off in this small little corridor here. There'll be like a menu up there uh, asking people in public worlds not to battle in the lobby, um, just to like use the arena and stuff or whatever, but you can click that off. And then once you do that, you'll head over here over to the right where it says avatars and over here are going to be two pokeballs. I don't know what the pokeballs are. I assume that one up there is like a lure ball or something and the other one's like a safari ball or whatever uh, or a nest ball or I don't know, whatever it is. But there's going to be two different versions of avatars here. There's going to be the PC versions and the quest versions. Now, the differences between these two versions are going to be the PC ones. You can throw your Pokemon out and it's not like locked to your head position. So if you turn, it's not going to slide across the world or whatever. It'll actually stay where you throw it and you could like run off and just leave it there if you want. Anyway. <laughs> but you can only battle with the PC avatars with other people using another PC avatar. You can't battle PC to quest. Uh, it'll say it right up here as well. PC avatars have type advantages, higher quality, sound effects, and will stay in one place in the world but quest users cannot battle or see you unless you are in a quest avatar. So again, you can't use the PC avatars to battle the quest ones. Uh, same way you can't use quest to battle PC. You gotta use either two quest avatars or two PC avatars. So what we're gonna do is go over here to PC and the very first one up here on the top left is going to be the Ethan avatar. I picked the PC ones cause I like the PC ones better. Uh, if I can, if I can get up to, I'll oh, jump. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. <laughs> so here is the, I'm gonna keep saying Ethan until I actually look it up and see if that's his name. If it's not, oh well. <laughs> I guess this is using them from Pokemon Masters, if anything. But uh, here is the Ethan avatar. We don't have any sort of facial expressions or anything going on, but we do have in the expressions wheel, uh, we do have desktop controls and VR controls. And I just picked the VR controls. I will say on, if there's an avatar that has a mega evolution, I found that you have to go to the desktop controls in order to do the mega evolution. Um, otherwise, then you just back out and go and do the regular VR controls. So over here, you can see we have reposition Pokemon. That's if you want to place your Pokemon in a different location, like you threw it out too far or threw it at a weird angle. Um, you can aim the Pokeball, which will show a little thing on the, like a little marker on the floor. Uh, actually, we can go ahead and do this. Aim Pokeball. So you see right there, we got a little marker. So we got this marker here, and when I throw my Pokemon out, it'll land in that marker, and it'll be facing towards where that little peg is facing. So if we go back here, and normally I think this will be turned off, but if you toggle on Show Party, it'll take a Pokeball, and it'll spawn it on your left, and then you can just reach over and grab the Pokeball, put it in your hand, and then you swing your arm out, and you throw out the Pokemon. Ooh. <laughs> Now this is what I mean by the Pokemon stays in the world. Cause if this was the quest version, whenever I'd be spinning, so would uh, the Pokemon, it would just be flying around. That's why I like the PC version better. So this is just really cool that you get to throw out a Pokemon. You know what else is cool with this? Watch this. <laughs> you can pet it. <laughs> if, you, if you touch the Pokemon's head, you can pet it. That's really cool. That's a nice detail. <laughs> so next on our list, uh, I you can toggle on and off the, the HP bar. Let me go ahead and reposition the Pokemon just so I can set them further back so we can see them better. Uh, put him here. Does this work? Yeah, that works. So you can see how he has an HP bar above his, uh, his head. Does it say anything else? No, it's just an HP bar. I toggle that off and I toggle that back on. Now, when you battle other Pokemon, you'll use attacks and it'll attack any Pokemon that's nearby and it'll actually drop their health. So you can actually like fight and battle other people in VR chat in any world. <laughs> that's so cool. So we go over here to move set and each Pokemon has four moves of four moves available. <laughs> 
So Typhlosion over here has Focus Blast. Uh, also has Flamethrower. Has Earthquake. And then has Thunder Punch. <laughs> I think he has a nice move set. He's got a fighting type move, fire type move, ground type move, and an electric type move. And then during a battle, if your Pokemon's health drops below a certain point, you can always go to the bag and then you can use one of each of these potions. So you have a max potion, a super potion, and a regular potion. We'll go ahead and pick regular potion. And there we go. And you actually do only get one use of it. I, I guess the only way to use it again is to recall them, but we'll go ahead and use super potion. Same thing, max potion same effect <laughs> this is a really cool avatar so then what we can do is if you want to recall your pokemon what you do is you will grab your pokeball and you just kind of swing it again and it just like auto captures the pokemon you can just let go it'll go back on your wrist and then you can also just grab it again swing it out and there it goes again and then you just boop <laughs> and there it goes this is so cool <laughs> And then if we just go over here to the desktop controls, it's the same thing, just if you're playing with desktop instead of in VR. So go back and back. And then the only thing that's left is the quick actions, which you can adjust your, your avatar height, and it'll also adjust your Pokemon's height as well. So that's also really cool. So that is going to be it for this avatar video. So if you are looking for a Pokemon avatar, you're looking for one that actually allows you to battle other players, be sure to head over to this world, check out the rest of their avatars as well. I'll be making some future videos on them as well, kind of going over each of the Pokemon, and that'll be it for me today. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. <laughs> I had to try it a few times. <laughs> this is my favorite part. <laughs> All right. Bye, everyone. <laughs>